All right, guys, I'm at Walmart, and I didn't um, do an intro because I just didn't do it because I was like, I'm not going to find anything, but I got the um, Spider-Man uh, Homecoming effect on clearance for 15 which is a really good deal, so I might pick up a couple. Um, I got Cosmic, I got Wingsuit, which I already have. I have Beetle, I got Tombstone, which I already have. Um, I got Death Head, I want to price check that guy. And then they got more Beetles, but yeah. So I'm gonna price check a couple of these guys and see what's up. All right, guys. So I'm back from Walmart, and um, I didn't even do an introduction because I've been going around all day. I've been at TRU, I've been at GameStop, and it's not even in this video because there wasn't anything to be seen there. So, um, like I said in the intros that you did not see um, this week, I'm really not going to do too much hunting because at Think Geek on this Thursday at 8 a.m. A lot of them are opening up at at 8 a.m. of course and um, they're doing the Comic-Con exclusives uh, there so they're gonna be limit, limited supply so it's gonna be from 8 to noon so check that out in your area um, and then also since um, I'm a bit of a gamer Splatoon 2 comes out on Friday so with that and uh, Splatoon coming out it's just a lot of um budget you know got got a budget that all in but i did find the uh vulture um for 15 bucks so that's a great deal i still need i can't remember what i need that's that's horrible so much crap i've been accruing so i need to figure that out i need to see what i need to to finish him off um i know i do have a couple of doubles um, but I need to figure that out, right? Yeah, we got, we got to do that. So anyway, I, I'm not sure if my next hunt will be on Thursday at Think Geek, but it could be. I don't know. Maybe um, I'll stop in at a Walgreens or something. But you guys will know because you'll be along for the ride. So anyway, guys, um, I'll see you in the next video. All right, guys, so I'm here at Walmart, and it's crazy, so I couldn't get any footage of picking up this, but I got Usagi. Jimbo from TMNT and now I'm looking for the blue one um, But pretty stoked to have this love this character. So good luck in your hunt. It's Craig from not another retro title And I am going hunting for those SDCC uh, 2017 con exclusives um, I am heading to my think geek right now um, it is, I'm running a little late, it's about 7.40 in the morning, and they open at 8 a.m., so I know there's going to be a line, and there's only a few overall that I'm really wanting to get, and then I'm good, because um, one already got um, the Amazon exclusive Snoke, I got him last night, so I wanted him, he's marked off the list. I'm actually doing a trade with my buddy Jonathan for the NECA, um, Grim Reaper from Bill and Ted, so mark that off the list. And then um, I'm looking for the the Negatron, uh, Darkwing Duck, the Black and White from Think Geek. Maybe the uh, R2 and Leia two pack from Think Geek. And then from Barnes and Nobles, I'm gonna check that there after Think Geek uh, if I don't hit Hot Topic. And I want the um, Let's see, definitely the Scare Glow. He's probably my number one that I want out of all of this, the Scare Glow from Masters of the Universe. Um, I also want to get, what's the other, uh, I need to pick up a Tigger. And then, what is the other one? I can't think of it right now, but um, there's one more. Oh, the Tick, the Tick, the Tick would be pretty sweet. And then I think I am good. I'm like I'm I'm good I'm happy so I'm already happy because I got two of them and I think I should at least find an, another one or two so I'm good um, also later today I'm gonna hit up TRU 
because the NECA Predator 30th anniversary figs are starting to pop up. I want the uh, the Dutch, the one that, you know, he's all muddy. Uh, we saw at the New York Toy Fair, and um, we'll, we'll see. I don't know. So let's go check out how crazy this line's going to be. Let's go see. All right, just going to think TV and see what they got. We have one door open. It's pretty packed. Let's check it out. Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm with Kevin Vallejo, and we're at Think Geek. What did you uh, What did you end up picking up? Uh, nothing. Nothing. I wanted the Megazord, and it's quick. Quick, man. So quick. there's a pretty good line, as you can see over there. He said the what's left right now? Um, I got some Man Bats left. Uh, the Joker, Batman. I think Star Wars is left. But uh, Sweet. that's about it. Going into Hot Topic. I think they said five per customer, so we'll see what they get. That's crazy. Okay. Alright. Good. Also, if you would like to box up your See if we can get the mountain. There they are. All right, guys. So I got the mountain. Pretty sick. What's going on, guys? I am back, and I had got what I wanted. It was awesome. They were stocked up. Box lunch, hot topic, and think Geek were stocked up. Um, I missed out on. Let's see. What was it? Barnes and Noble because I wanted that Scarecrow, that Scarecrow. Um, but uh, my aunt actually stood in line for me and she got it for me, so thanks, appreciate that. But this is what I got. I um, got the Think Geek exclusive of R2 and Princess Leia, pretty sweet. And then I got the Negatron uh, Darkwing Duck, which I love, it's glow in the dark. And then at a hot topic, I went in and uh, you know there really wasn't anything that I just really really wanted. So then I went to box lunch and I picked up the mountain. I got the mountain. He is pretty sick. I'm super excited about him. Um, and then I went back to Think Geek and um, ended up picking up the man bat because I was thinking about it when I was standing in line I was like you know what I really wanted that man bat and I went in and they were completely stocked so this is awesome it's a great haul um, I'm pumped I'm pumped I got what I wanted and um, I'm going to try to go to TRU to get that 30th uh, anniversary Dutch so I'm stoked guys so I hope you had as good luck as I did um, but anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Let's see if I have time to get Toys R Us. And like I said earlier, I'm looking for the uh, NECA 30th anniversary Predator uh, and or Dutch. Or just one of them because I spent some cash today on this SDCC exclusives, which I'm happy. Like, it was a really, really great day for hunting. And hopefully Toys R Us will uh, top the day off um, and make it uh, one for the books. So anyway, guys, let's go see what they get. All right, guys, so I found Predator the, from the 30th and Dutch. Which one do I get? Which one do I get? I'm thinking I'm gonna go with Dutch just because I have so many Predators. That is an awesome thing. They still have one, one Drago and this creature thing is pretty sweet. I just really want the accessories in there to do other stuff. And then they have that alien xenomorph. They have pegs of that. 
They had this Thor fig. He looks pretty gnarly. I mean, his face is like, yeah. Gonna rip some shit up. I got a beard. Oh, wait. He's got the two pack. Man, he's just got that head on him. That head's huge. I like that Iron Man. I don't need another Spidey, but I do want that Iron Man. I think I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass on him. And then these guys don't see anything too crazy on the legends. Oh no, let's go check out World of Guys, I'm back and I am very, very excited to have picked up the NECA 30th anniversary. This guy, this guy. <laughs> So I'm very excited to pick up Dutch uh, the, in jungle mode, right? So when he's hiding out from the Pred, it's pretty sweet in the back art right there. He's in the forest. This is going to be some pretty sweet picks. So I can't wait to do that. And I'll do that coming up as well. Um, so check your Toys R Us's for the 30th anniversary. There's many different ones. I think one's uh, exclusive. So check that out. If you're into NECA and Predator, um, I didn't pick up that other Predator, man, because it's just like, I have so many already, and they all look very similar. So it's just kind of, um, I needed this Dutch, or I wanted this Dutch, and then also I still need to get the Thermal Dutch, too. So that's going to end it for this video, but I am going to pick up the uh, Scare Glow and the Tigger uh, exclusive pops that my aunt picked up for me. She she was clutch today so thank you very much and um i'm gonna go get those and show you guys and then that's a wrap that's done my day is done it was very successful and uh i'm i'm more than thrilled um very pleased with what i got the only thing that i want that i didn't get was the baxter stockman um walmart uh pop but you know i'm good it's all good i'm happy so anyway guys so back and I picked up the uh, Scare Glow and the Tigger Barnes & Noble exclusives and I wanted to show you guys because they are pretty sick and I'm going to stick by it. I think the Scare Glow is uh, my favorite exclusive pop but we'll start off with the Tigger. He is pretty cool. Um, he has the, the flocked uh, vinyl so it looks furry or whatever. He is pretty cool and this was the Barnes & Noble exclusive which is pretty sweet so I'm glad to got that and then uh, my ulti ultimate find that I didn't even find but my aunt did was the uh, scare glow so I am a big Masters of the Universe uh, fan ever since I was a kid and uh, when I saw that there this was gonna be released I, I knew I had to have it so oh here's my dog so what's up George oh what's up what's up what's going on but anyway, um, but he is pretty cool and he glows in the dark. And then on the other ones, you got He-Man and uh, She-Ra, Skeletor, Spike War, and Hordak. So, but I'm just glad to have freaking Scare Glow because I didn't think I was going to get them. And I love the side art, uh, Grayskull Castle, Castle Grayskull uh, background. So that is freaking sick. I'm excited to have this. So anyway guys, thank you for watching and coming along for this. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and leave uh, me a comment on what you ended up getting at for the uh, SDCC exclusives. And uh, guys, thanks a lot and I will see you in the next vid. Later.